Hi, I'm Christine Gagne, Regional Sales Manager with Collabware, North America East and EMEA, and welcome to our very first Collab Chat. Hi, I'm David Garçon, Regional Sales Manager for North America West, Latin America, and Asia Pacific, and I'm glad to be here. Collabware's goal is to help enterprises and governments free themselves from information chaos by offering scalable building block solutions to connect and protect their data while providing a powerful tool to perform e-discovery functions and that automates record activities to meet legislative and regulatory compliance. That's right, David. In one of our regular team collaboration meetings, we were asking each other, how can we create more awareness about Collabware and our unique approach to records management? How can we share what we're hearing and seeing across virtually every vertical? And how can we convey how we solve common information challenges that result in so many successful client stories? So we came up with this idea of delivering a weekly series of micro videos, five minutes or less, we call Collab Chat. I think you would agree that everyone at Collabware takes tremendous pride in being a disruptor in the information management industry. And that's certainly true by how we do things. We're very much a pineapple in a world of apples. And one of the ways we're different is with our data lake. I totally agree, Christine. So we thought for our very first collab chat, it was worth explaining how our approach is different, starting with our data lake. David, can you please explain what a data lake is in our information management world? Of course. Simply put, a data lake is a type of data repository that has a flat architecture that provides not only capacity for storing large volumes of information, but also the ability to perform real-time computations on the data stored within. So how is this different from a typical repository? Well, to give our viewers an idea of how this is different than a typical repository, I like to discuss how a traditional repository works. I'll use file shares as an example. In my adventures with customers, I have referred them as the Russian dolls of records and information management with much agreement. Their hierarchical structure lends itself to have an infinite number of folders within folders, which is good for storing data, granted that you remember where you store that data, otherwise it can become very cumbersome to find what you want quickly. Furthermore, file shares are only meant for storage, as they lack the processing power to manage data intelligence, meaning that this will never be able to provide you insights about your data. In contrast, a data lake by design has a flat architecture, i.e. no more of that Russian doll effect, Plus, it was designed to process large volumes of data in order to provide analysis of its contents. Therefore, there's so many advantages to a data lake approach. You're bang on, David. Just like the body of water, the data lake is a reserve that all types of data, whether text or image based, processed or raw, can be streamed in all different sources. Data lake solutions are beneficial to records management because they provide organizations with a single source to back up and safeguard their information. Our data lake platform, Collab Space, connects to a variety of content sources, allowing for a constant stream of data to flow into it. This allows for immediate archiving of data while bringing control and visibility to an organization's structured and unstructured data assets. Each data element in the lake is automatically tagged by Cloud Space with a set of metadata tags, so users can access and gain the most insights from whatever is stored. All of this is driven by the power of AI and machine learning, a process we call data enrichment. The data lake also enables information retention and protection with compliant archive and backup into a ransomware proof worm compliant storage system worm for those who don't know is write once read many which points to the fact that users can never tamper with or delete data something that auditors and regulatory bodies see as a key part of data protection so to summarize compared with traditional record management solutions or companies that have multiple silo repositories our data lake collapse space makes everything accessible by taking in all of your data regardless of format or content source so users can rest assured that the information is being protected immediately. Plus, it gives them the ability to locate information at any time. Therefore, the real value of our data lake is being able to give time back to users and records managers by providing warm compliant storage, ease of data access regardless of content source, and by providing near real-time insights on structured and unstructured data. Excellent, David. Well, that wraps up our very first collab chat. How do you feel about being part of this pineapple world? 
Amazing. Much sweeter than an apple. So what's next? Now that we've discussed the data lake as a foundation, we will be looking at four building blocks for achieving unstructured data intelligence, which are security, active data accessibility, basic insights, and deeper insights in machine learning. We're looking forward to our next collab chat. Please leave us with your comments and feedback. Goodbye and stay tuned for next week. Thanks for watching.